Marcus Rashford front and centre. He's been in terrific form as evidenced by four goals in three games. Stay with us. Hello there, sad to say the weather hasn't cooperated today. It's absolutely lashing down here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester United facing Brighton and Hove Albion. Thank you, Derek. Just flicking through my notes at this one. Everything points into a really lively matchup. This is fingers crossed, eh? Number five, Harry Maguire. Number 27, Alex Telle. Number 17, Fred. And number six, Paul Pogba. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea starts in goal. David Alaba plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Fred starts alongside Paul Pogba in central midfield. And handed a solo role in attack is Marcus Rashford. And the match gets underway here at Old Trafford. Let's hope we're in for something special. He takes aim. Good defending to prevent the chance. Blocks again. Mopé. Lost possession. Just tell us, Lee, what you think. The... Can they forge ahead? What an important piece of defending. Well, real excitement here. I say that because it is his long-awaited debut coming up. What should we be looking for from him, Lee? Well, he should be in the thick of it today. Central midfield is where it's at. The engine room of any team. He'll be expected to chip in with all aspects of that midfield play. Let's just see how he settles in. Big day for him today, Derek. Prepare. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And he's given us away. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Manchester United were the victors against West Ham United. How will they fare in this match, Lee? Well, Derek, it was easy enough for them in their last game. A 3-0 home win. Another win for me today. Same again. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, they've lost the ball. More than decent, this, from United. Must score! Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And the corner has been given. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. And he's fired over the corner. And he clears the danger. Alex Tellez. Can he find the net? Well, body in the way. He's driven in the corner. Well, that is a moment I'm sure he wishes he could have back. Well, he did everything right, the movement and everything. He got his head on it, but it's way, way off target. Lalana, And that's an important intervention. Making progress. Can he open them up here? Given away again. Well, United have been very much in control over the last 15 minutes, Derek. They really have put the pressure on. You feel their play deserves a goal, but will they get one? They need to just be a little bit better, a little bit more clinical. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Oh, they've lost it. Kevin. Here's Ajork. Lost possession.
Donny van der Beek. They've regained possession. Ryan Thomas. Adam Webster. Dunk on the ball. And it's United's turn now. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Now the attack fizzled out. Kevin. Well, the ref will hear the crowd all right. We can hear him from here. He's taking some stick. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, it could be on for him here. Can he find the net? Oh, yes! 1-0 it is! And it doesn't come as a huge surprise! And that will do it. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Ryan Thomas. Dunk on the ball. Van der Beek. Rashford. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Now the delivery, attending to his defensive chores. Well, plenty of interest in Wolves and what they've been doing on the transfer front. Good news for Wolves fans, Lee. New signing in place. Well, yeah, certainly a lot of focus on the boy over the last year or two. Seems to have a bright future ahead of him, he really does. Hopefully it turns out to be a good move for him and he can continue his development. And turned out of play, so it will be a throw-in. Could play it in. And it might be. Well, the keeper had to concentrate. And United have the corner. Over it comes. A really disappointing effort, you've got to say. Well, he's way, way off target. A real poor effort with his head. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Lalana. Ryan Thomas. Davy Prupper. Just a quick reminder we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Manchester United facing Southampton. Well, that should be a really interesting matchup atmosphere. I'm sure we're going to get an absolute belter, Derek. From the bake. Well, no stopping him. Not even close in the end, Lee. Well, he's had a go, Derek. He's gone for power, but the accuracy. He just wasn't there, was it? Well, the ball lost here. Well, it's been all United in the last 15 minutes or so, Derek. They've created a lot from midfield. Their forwards are having a field day. Coach will be really happy with the creativity, but he'd be even happier if he can extend that. In position, the keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Corner kick played in. Just too much height on that one. Close shave, though. Oh, well, he knows that could have been the game right there. You can see his frustration as well. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Brighton and Hove Albion facing Arsenal. Yeah, that looks a great matchup, doesn't it? Looking forward to some fast-flowing football there. Spot on with that tackle.
Joel Feldman. Beautifully timed. Not a particularly strong challenge. It's going to be United's free kick. Well, Derek, here's the replay, and great goals come in all shapes and sizes. This is a pearler of a set piece, and nothing two keepers could do about this. A brilliant finish. Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and your sense there's going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. So, 2 0 now. Goal for Manchester United. Number six. Paul Pogba. Only ten minutes remaining here. Dunk. Adam Webster. Throw-ins given. And a substitution in the offing. Coming off the pitch, number 27, Alex Mope. Coming onto the pitch, Thomas. Number 23, Luke Shaw. He just needs to keep a cool head. Big chance. Not finished yet. Not quite yet. Still excitement left in the game. So there we have it. 2-1. Superbly read and executed. Now, what on earth happened there? And the cross smuggled away. And he slots it home with confidence. There it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. One minute remaining. And they have possession again. Getting in there to take it away. I must say this looks promising. And that is the end of the game. It goes down.
the man to watch. Up against his former club, will he make an impact live on EA TV? And this is the scene here at St Mary Stadium on the south coast of England. I'm Derek Ray. With me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And we've... Oh, big chance! And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders, but let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. Well, the manager's showing signs of frustration. They need to improve it. They're going to get something out of this game, Derek. Underway once more, Manchester United have hit the front. Shelby. Well, he's the player many people have focused on in the build-up to today's match. Playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Lee. Well, Derek, whilst the occasion for him is a nice one and there'll be lots of smiley faces surrounding you when you meet old friends, etc., I can tell you those smiley faces, every single one of them, will want you to have a nightmare and fall flat on your face when the game starts. It could be a tricky day for him today. Best of God. And attempting the through ball. And he's found a bit of daylight. And that is how to endear yourself to the fans in your debut. Well, he's in dreamland. It's all going to plan and then some. Martial. And he takes on the shot. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Let's join Alan McAnally because I'm hearing this fine reaction from the keeper. Yeah, it looked like a good opportunity to be fair, but the keeper was more than equal to it. Well, for understandable reasons, we had to cut off Alan McAnally. Just to confirm, Leeds United have scored in that match. And it's now even Steven, 1-1. Shelby. Here's Walcott. Over the top intended for Theo Walcott. Now they're on the scent of something positive and punched away. And he did well to cut it out. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Martial! And a goal it is to put them in front again! No less than they deserve! Behind on this game now, Southampton. What will they do in an attacking sense? A move of promise on the flank. And in with a real chance. And putting his body on the line. Good pressure high up the pitch. Must score. And a goal. The quick one too. And they've turned this game on its head. Well, here's the goal again. And he's just been caught napping, hasn't he? Had his pocket picked, rightly punished, schoolboy stuff. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It could be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. So there it is, 3 1, the current scoreline here. Ward Prowse. We can go to Alan McAnally now for news of a goal in the Wolves game. Alan. It's a goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. 32 minutes played. 1 1. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. And what a cross work out for them. 
And cleared away. Genepo. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Bruno Fernandes. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Throw-ins given. Well, United in control with their possession. It's important to have strong, dominant players in your mid... In with a chance! Offside the decision. <laughs> possession lost. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Oh, nice ball. Genepo. Options in the middle. Corner awarded. Well, sometimes you forget about Anthony Martial and then all of a sudden he gives you cause to remember, Lee. Well, his movement is so good. You can see why he causes defenders so much trouble and a goal to boot as well. Now the managers will now deliver the... So underway again here, the pendulum having already swung United's way. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. Not an especially strong challenge. Might be a chance here. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Ward-Prowse. Ball with Shelby. Well, many have wondered for a while, would this happen? Now I can tell you, it is definitely going to happen. Rafael Guerrero has completed his move to Atletico League. Well, it's a reported fee of around £45 million, Derek. He's definitely worth that sort of money in my book. Good, solid pro. Technically really gifted too. James. Bruno Fernandes. Ings. Kyle Walker-Peters has it. And news coming through of a goal on the Leeds United match, Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Raheem Sterling. An awful back pass put him in the clear, and he easily beat the keeper. 50. Will he finish? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. And now the delivery. Fine reaction from the keeper. Yeah, it looked like a good opportunity, to be fair, but the keeper was more than equal to it. Well, a fine first-half showing from Bruno Fernandes. Lee, what have you made of what he's put into the game? Well, Derek, he's had a stormer, hasn't he? Scored a goal. He's certainly troubled all the defenders around there as well. I think there's more to come in the second half. Walcott. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Marcus Rashford on to Van der Beek. Oh, a nice looking pass. Van der Beek. Great opportunity. That's excellent defending following the cross. And they'll get ready for the throw in. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. And he was in the right place to intercept. And he takes it away. Bruno Fernandes, teammate available. Oh yes, it's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment.
Well, as we can see again here, he knows exactly what he's doing and kids all the defenders with the cutback. And then it's probably the easiest tap-in he will ever get. Lovely stuff. Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and you sense there's going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. On they go again, and United beginning to run away with this. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Southampton taking on Brighton. Yeah, I'm predicting a cracker there. Both teams will have a real go at each other, I'm sure. Let's join Alan McAnally because I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Leeds United match. Alan. It's a second goal. Chance here. The goal seems to be at his mercy, but defenders don't always have to touch the ball to have an influence. No, it's that pressure that comes from the defender that makes him hurry his shot. Close. Well, there's just no cohesion, Derek, in this defence, and they're taking full advantage. They're creating so much from midfield, and the forwards are having a half-decent day as well. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Only ten minutes remaining here. Bruno Fernandes. Crossing possibilities. A decisive clearance it was. Wasteful from United. And he whips it in. A deft clearance. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. And news coming through of a goal in the Leeds United match. Alan McAnally. It's another goal for Manchester City. Four minutes remain. 4-2. Thanks, Alan. Slipshod passing. And they are on the move again. Shaw. Credit to them for winning back possession. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Competent goalkeeping. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points picked up, Lee. Well, Derek, with a defence like they've got, the forwards should be chomping at the bit in every game. They did the business today. And all in all, a really solid team effort. Well done. Just a couple of questions for you. Thank you.
It is opening night. A huge night for both sets of fans. Match day one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world. Old Trafford in Manchester. My name is Derek Ray and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Manchester United facing RB Leipzig. Yeah, it's very important that you're not playing catch-up in the group stages. Match day one, imperative. You get off to a good start. And successfully cut out. A room to Rome on the wing. It needs an accurate cross. Now sliding in field. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Over it comes. Corner once more. And now the delivery. Corner again. Played into the center of the box. But the keeper takes command. Just not looking confident in possession. Match day one in the Champions League. Always exciting. And as soon as the teams were drawn into this particular group, we all thought, my goodness, that's a hard one to predict the outcome of. Oh, wow, well, the so-called group of death. It really is a competitive one, this one. Imperative, you get off to a good start. You don't want to be playing catch-up when there's two teams like that ahead of you. And the referee blows for a foul. It looks promising. Not a fantastic piece of defending. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. And firing it into the area. Well, he was being very closely marked, but the header not on the target. No, just off target, and the thing is, the defender did his job, and he just couldn't quite get enough of his head on it. Alex Tellez has it. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? He's protecting it effectively. Luis Araujo. It's a fine United move in the making. Given away by Manchester United. Kevin Campbell. And now with Angelino. Luis Araujo. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, no way through. A bit sloppy in possession. Havertz. Real chance. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Well, he can't let the frustrations get the better of him, Derek. His players need help here. One nil then. Verbic. It is to be a throw in. 
Well, as you can see, United haven't had too much of the ball, but on the break, they've been devastating. The pace really hurts defences. They've been electric when they've had the ball. Well, possession seeded. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in one of the other games. Alan McAnally can fill us in. It's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain. Can he put it away? Havertz! And a goal! They've had it to the lead. Much needed security. So, 2-0 now. Well, we did have to cut Alan McAnally short there. To confirm, Paris Saint-Germain have scored in that match. And their lead stands at 1-0 presently. And we will have just one additional minute. Can they create something from here? And Fred winkling possession away from the opposition. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's having a terrific game in attack, Lee. Well, Derek, is what I used to call a pest. Never lets up, always asking questions of you as a defender. Questions you don't normally have the answer to. That's why he gets so many goals. Now, slow. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Verbic. Now with Upamecano. Kevin Kampel. Mukiele. Halstenberg has it. Nkunku. It's with Verbic. Upamecano. Paulinho and the pass a good one Upamecano wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up well many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal they've succeeded late well in the autumn of his career now it's a nice little move for him he could reduce the deficit oh dear that moment might come back to haunt them. A bad miss. Well, they needed that one to go in for sure. There won't be many more chances like that in the game, you feel. Havertz. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. And breaking at pace with Menace. Marcel Zabitza. Crossing opportunity. Magnificent defending. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Manchester United facing Aston Villa. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams to make that game a real cracker. You should be tuning in for that one. Upamecano. Leipzig enjoying the bulk of possession here, but after that it's been disappointing. I'd like to see them use those wide areas around the defence, get round them as opposed to trying to go through the middle. Bruno Fernandes. So, 20 minutes to go. Jadon Sancho. Getting in there to intercept. Paulinho. It's a weighted pass. And offside. Well, close one.
Substitution time it is here. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Might be able to produce from this position. Verbic. A deft clearance. More than decent this from United. And the cross is very much on. Can he finish? And a little too close to the keeper in the end. Konrad Leimer. Jaden Sancho. Not high quality defending. Marcus Rashford. Rashford. And he's broken free. Still a chance. Well, they can bring it out now. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. A sloppy pass. Full time, and Manchester United claim all three points in their opening fixture in the...